Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Shukesh once again. Thanks a lot, guys, for the amazing response on the battery drain test. Today, let's compare the battery charging speed of these three devices. On my left, I have the OnePlus 6 featuring a 3300 mAh lithium polymer battery and the outgoing OnePlus flagship that is OnePlus 5T also packs the same battery. But on my previous video, you have seen OnePlus 6 improves over OnePlus 5T in battery backup. Now dash charging is one of the standout features of OnePlus devices and these dash chargers are rated 20 watt 5 volt crazy 4 ampere output rating which offers unparalleled battery charging speed. There we have the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus probably the best all-in-one Android device you can go for right now and it packs a bigger 3500 mAh lithium-ion battery with quick charge 2.0 support. This adaptive fast charger is rated 9V 1.67A and 5V 2A that is 10 to 15 watt depending on the battery level. Now the batteries inside these three devices are drained to 0%. Let's connect the chargers and track the charging speed. I will take the readings at 10, 20, 30, 45, 60 minutes and also when the devices charges to 100%. Well, it's ready so let's start the stopwatch and switch on the power supply. I want to let you know that I am not using any kind of multi-plug. All the chargers are directly connected to the main line. As I mentioned before, I will come back after 10 minutes to take the readings and also I will turn on the devices as most of us charge our phones keeping them on. Don't go anywhere, I will come back after 10 minutes. It's almost 10 minutes on the stopwatch, so let's quickly check the battery levels. OnePlus 6 is at 19%, S9 Plus is at 12% and lastly you have OnePlus 6T also at 19%. From my experience I can tell you with 19% battery level you can use OnePlus 5T or OnePlus 6 for about 3 to 4 hours at least considering you won't play any kind of games or play any YouTube videos. Check my battery discharge test to get the clear idea. OnePlus 6 just turned 20% as you can see, with 12% battery S9 Plus can run for about 1.5 hours to 2 hours max. I just turned on the devices as I told you before, I will come back at the 20 minutes mark. Stay tuned. So another 10 minutes have passed, let's quickly check OnePlus 6 which is at superb 36%, about half a days of battery backup. S9 Plus is now at 22%. Estimated charging time remaining is 1 hour and 21 minutes. We will check that out. At the end of this video, I will also show you a line graph of the charging speed to compare the charging characteristics of Dash Charger and Samsung's Adaptive Fast Charger. OnePlus 5T is at 39%. Let's check OnePlus 6 which is now at 37% so looks like OnePlus 5T is even charging faster than the all new OnePlus 6. The charging time remaining is 36 minutes on OnePlus 6 and 33 minutes on 5T. In the meantime S9 Plus increased to 23% of battery level. I will come back at the 30 minutes mark and take another reading. Guys, I'm back. Let's quickly check the battery status. OnePlus 6 is now at 54%. It's worth noticing the charging speed is almost consistent. I mean, it was 19, then 37, 54. S9 Plus is now at 33% after 30 minutes of charging with the provided adaptive fast charger. OnePlus 5T is now at 57%. Still, it's ahead of OnePlus 6 by 2%. Let's see what happens at the end. Samsung's fast charger cannot compete with dash charger. I mean, Samsung is now more cautious with their battery. At higher battery levels, dash charger becomes slower whereas adaptive fast charger is more consistent. Let's wait till the end. Guys, it's already 45 minutes on the stopwatch. So OnePlus 6 is now at 79%. Enough for a full day's backup. Samsung flagship is now at 
51%, good for more or less half a days of backup. OnePlus 5T is now at well same as OnePlus 5T that is 79%. So OnePlus 6 is speeding up. I don't know which device will win this speed test. Definitely not S9 Plus which is about 28% behind. But as I mentioned before the scenario might change at the end so stay tuned. It's exactly one hour on the stopwatch. Still none of the OnePlus devices are fully charged. OnePlus 6 is now at 91%. Just 6 minutes left for full charge but definitely it will take longer. S9 Plus is now at 69% and OnePlus 5T is at again 91% same as OnePlus 6. As you can see the line graph slope is lowering a little bit. It should be more or less the same for OnePlus 6 whereas S9 Plus's graph is almost a straight line. I will prepare a graph for you. Let's wait for the OnePlus devices to charge to 100%. One thing I should mention here, there is no SIM in S9 Plus. Samsung devices show network bar even if there is no SIM in them. Guys, we are at the final part of this battery speed test and the good news is both OnePlus 6 as well as OnePlus 5T turned 100% almost at the same time i mean oneplus 6 was like three or four seconds faster than oneplus 5t but the leds turned green at about one hour and 27 minutes on the stopwatch so that's quite fast as you can see on the graph at higher battery levels dash charger works pretty slow now though s9 plus started really bad right now it's at 91 percent still the graph is almost a straight line but of course it will get slower now on this battery usage stats are not for this session i mean there is no application running in the background also i have disabled all the add-on features of these phones so once again dash charger is just amazing you get about 57 percent battery charge within half an hour battery backup is also pretty good on the oneplus devices now let's have a quick look at the line graph S9 Plus took 21 minutes more to charge to 100% so the total charging time is 1 hour and 49 minutes. Well as you can see guys OnePlus's dash charger and Samsung's fast charger works completely differently. At lower battery levels dash charger provides super fast battery charging whereas adaptive fast charger of Samsung is much slower but more consistent. I mean if your battery level is about 75 or 80 percent already then S9 Plus might charge faster than OnePlus. But the sole purpose of fast charging is high speed battery charge when your phone is running out of juice. So definitely I would go for OnePlus dash charger anytime. The total charging time difference is just 21 minutes which I really don't care about. 37 or 39 percent battery in just 20 minutes or 57% battery in just half an hour might save your day. Thank you so much guys for watching this full video. You guys are awesome. Please consider sharing this with your friends. This is Shukesh signing off. Don't forget to subscribe and keep in touch.